Hello everyone. I want to welcome you to the latest update on my Carnage comic collection. I haven't done one of these updates in quite a while and I have added quite a few books to, since the last update. Don't know exactly how many comics are in the collection but here's a quick look. Now this is not the entire collection this is most of them, but all of them won't fit on my bed. So after I show you this, I'll take the rest of them out and show you those. But before I do that, let's take a little look at each cover and maybe talk a little bit about some of them. I really like this one. And this is done by Scotty Young, in case you're not familiar with his style very distinctive unique style now this one this is one of my latest editions when i first saw this i was like man why are his eyes showing and i didn't like it at first but then it grew on me because it's kind of weird kind of alien looking and it's different from the normal carnage look so i, I really like this one now That one is really cool right there. Also, spooky, scary looking. I think Cornet should look like an alien and he should look more like a creature than a human. I think that's a lot of missed opportunity. 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 Man, words are hard. All right, and in case you're not familiar with Del Otto, I hope I'm saying his name right. These are four covers by him. And to be honest, I'm not sure if some of these are Venom or Carnage, but they read, so I'm going with Carnage. Have you noticed that Carnage does appear on a lot of Venom covers? Prime example is right here. That's Carnage. Okay, that's a Venom book right there, and that's Carnage on the cover. Now, I think that's the Venom, well, not the Venom, but I think that's Venom right there in dinosaur form. But again, that's a Venom cover. Another Venom book. Yeah, I always wondered about that. Why does he appear on so many Venom covers? And a lot of times, Venom is not on the cover with him. All right, no big deal. Just thinking out loud. Also, folks, I don't really necessarily collect by the series or volumes or runs or anything. If it's a nice Carnage cover... I'll get it. If it's a Cornish book and it's not a so nice cover, I won't get it. I always enjoyed art and love some beautiful Cornish cover art. All right, I'm gonna have to go around the bed to look at the rest, but first I wanna show you these special books I have here. Hope you can see, because there is a lot of glare, that scream. I got that for just a few dollars. I'm not real big into the graded books, but I got that at a price I couldn't pass up. And we all familiar with these books here. And I have to get one more to have that three book run complete. I actually sold these two, these two I bought I bought them back, I should say that. I should put it that way. I bought them back. I had all three and I sold all three and I'm slowly trying to buy them back. And of course, they're more expensive to buy them back. But that's a whole nother story. 
All right, hold on. I'll be right back. And these are some more of my special books. And I just acquired this one. Yeah, this one right here. Just this week. I've wanted that bad boy for a long time. Just couldn't afford it. It was out of my price range. I won it in an auction and got it for a really good price. And that is Clayton Crank. Clayton Crane, I always get his name mixed up. It's like a, a superhero secret identity name like Clark Kent, Peter Parker, Reed Richards, Clayton Crane. But anyway, yeah, finally got that bad boy. Nice cover. Now, let me see, where am I? Okay, these are my international books right here. This one, printed in Russian. And this is an art book, but this one did come from Mexico, and it's in Spanish. This one is in German. This one came from Germany. And these three are in Italian, and these came from Italy. So these are my international books right here. That's a beautiful, nice cover. I think this is foil or something. It's kind of glossy, reflective type. Can't really tell that much through the plastic, but that is so cool. get a view from here I think I got them all as much as I can get in the screen on the screen all right folks hold on one minute I'll be back with the rest of the collection I am back once again and this is the rest of the collection and you will notice that a lot of these right here are venom books and a couple of screen books, but these are part of my Carnage collection. And of course, there are some Spider-Man books here also. Now, this is the ultimate Carnage character. Another Scotty Young cover. In case you're not familiar with that cover, or I shouldn't say in case you don't recognize it, that is this same cover right here. Some of these, some of these Venom covers are really wild. In case you weren't paying attention, just take a really close look at that. Tell me what you see. Tell me what you see. That is crazy. It took me a while to notice that, but that's something else. All right, folks, that's about it. I think I'm going to end this video with one shot of the entire collection as much as I can squeeze onto the bed and call this a wrap. Hold on, I'll be right back. Well, spreading all of the collection out didn't work, so I decided to go with this red, white, and black theme here. These are all of the covers with majority red, white, and black on the cover. 
All right, folks, thanks for watching this video. Thanks for supporting the channel. Bye. And I almost forgot, there is one cover that appears twice in this video. And I'm not talking about the Spider-Man cover that I showed you. If you can tell me what book that is, there may be a no prize coming your way. If you don't know what a no prize is, shame on you. Do some research. Anyway, thanks folks. Bye.